I'm the mayor of Moss Village. Would you like to hear more about our wonderful town? Huh? Huh? We lived and prospered in harmony. Until one day, a gift left behind by a legendary hero was taken. The Radiant Cube. A cube? It must be one of the puzzle pieces that leads to the heart of the forest. Um, excuse me, Mayor? Uh, do you have any clue where this cube might be now? It is hidden in the swamp behind this village, but it is guarded by the most dangerous creatures this side of the creek. Blood Dragons. <gasps> Tell me more. The Blood Dragons terrorized our village for years, draining the life force of any who challenged them. We've long waited for a hero to send these beasts back to the putrid puddle from which they came. Mayor of Moss Village, I am but a humble archer, but joined by my trusty mage Craig, the brave warrior Kelsey, and the bardic knowledge of JP. You won't find a more balanced party. Oh, in melee range, a sixth grader? That's a pretty good team build right here. All right, you may enter the swamp. I'll alert my guard. Hey, Gary! Yeah? Let him in this time, will ya? Okay. Hold up, we're gonna need some more gear for this. Hello, fair traveler. Got anything good for battling blood dragons? Oh, headed to the swamp, I see. Then I would recommend the blood dragon armor. Wow, what won't they put in a can? To the swamp! No enemies in this area. So far. Look! A treasure chest! The cube's gotta be in there. Ah, blood dragons! Mosquitoes! I mean, blood dragons! We've come for the Radiant Cube! Leave this swamp and the people of Moss Village for good! Well, if that's how you wanna play it, my arrows will not miss! Kelsey, you're up! Lucky treat. Thank you. Mm. How do you keep it so fresh, Kit? It's a little winky wink, if you know what I wink. A trade secret. Mmm. Ah, uh, huh? Did you bug off, bug? Did someone say bug? <laughs> oh, yeah, I yelled it. Funny you should yell that. Behold, a universal bug spray! Specially formulated repellent that will ward off any insect in the universe, including those from non-carbon-based planets. Oh my, Maria Marion. Here we go again. Hey, Carl. Hey, Faraday. Universal bug spray? It's pretty cool. Ugh. This is not officially sanctioned Alliance of Science Research. This is all Ren's madness. Well, this is certainly the most practical experiment Ren's conducted in recent memory. A spray to repel extraterrestrial insects is practical? True. The spray's effectiveness against off-world swarms is a lofty promise. But what matters is that it works against earthly bugs like this! <sighs> Observe! Huh? Uh-oh. Up here, human shield, Kirk! <coughs> it stinks! <laughs> Creek. It's all ruined, and it's all my fault. No, it's mine. I added an extra ingredient to your bug solution. 
You did what? I didn't want your experiment to be a failure. You deal mostly in relativistic quantum mechanics. Biochemistry isn't exactly your chosen field. I was worried you'd be out of your league, and I didn't want you to embarrass yourself. So if none of this was my fault, then my science can still save us! Kit, what sort of supplies do you got? We don't need to overpower the stench. We need to neutralize it! Aha! Baking soda! Of course! Baking soda absorbs odor! That must be Kit's winky wink. The acid from the salt and vinegar chip should do the trick. Doubted you. You can say it. I was right! I was right! I was right! <gasps> Bobby! My candy. Hey, Kit. Three sandwiches for the heroes of the creek. One box of chocolate rolls. A whole box? That's like the opposite of a hero discount. Hero or villain, trade prices are gonna be higher until I can trade my way to a new cool. I only got enough for an open face sandwich. <laughs> well, can't breathe through my nose once again, but it looks delicious. I guess things really are back to normal. <laughs> and then we'll transfer your neurons into the brain of someone who's good at softball. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>